for any of you hunters or outdoors folks, uh, if you've ever taken a deer or a fish uh, to get taxidermy and you wonder that guy behind the counter, how do they do that every day, all day, 365 days a year? Well, chances are your taxidermist is a guardian. So let me tell you about a guardian. Guardians are unselfish, approachable, uh, and have a real preference towards detail work. So again, in the context of, of uh, predictive index, we're always measuring or assessing the drives. Those drives create needs, and if I can identify a person's needs, then I can predict the kind of behavior uh, that they will uh, have. So here are the needs of a guardian. Guardians want reassurance, they want time, they need time to build trust in other people. They need freedom from changing priorities. They wanna know exactly what's expected of them and do it every day. And they need freedom from risk, ultra risk averse individuals. So here are the behaviors, those are the needs, the, they get expressed in these behaviors. They are helpful, they are pensive, they are steady and consistent and very diligent. So. As it pertains to how you leverage a guardian in the context of an organizational strategy and the outcomes, this is where when you've got something that's loosey-goosey, maybe you've initiated a new initiative over the last year and you're trying to figure out what to do with it or how to really maximize it or how to scale something, you need a guardian who can come in and take all of the minutia and the craziness and put order in it and put detail detail, detail around it. They are so gifted at nailing down the detail and getting it precise. That's how you use a guardian in the context of organizational strategy and the outcomes that you want to see. If, you got, if you're curious, if you've got a guardian on your team uh, or you need to find somebody, we can help you using the predictive index. Just reach out to us.